Hello, pretty people. Welcome to Simply Delish Duo. You guys, today we are making our zucchini tomato provolone slices with a leaf of basil on top. This is so yummy, super fast, and super delish. So if you like this recipe and would like to see more, please sub subscribe to our channel by hitting that red subscribe button below. So for this recipe, we will be using a medium to large zucchini, a few tomatoes, provolone cheese, some basil, um, extra virgin olive oil, black pepper, and some salt. So we love zucchini. My dad one year had so many zucchini in his garden, so I took some like, oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? So I cut them in half inch slices, and I took some tomatoes from his garden, took the basil from the garden, and I thought, perfect. My husband loves tomatoes, we lo both love zucchini, and I love provolone cheese. So what I did was I cut them in half inch slices, placed them on a ba baking sheet, sprinkled some, you know what, before I do this, we sprinkle just a little bit of olive oil, before I forget that part, and then add your black pepper, just a little sprinkle on each, a little bit of salt, then I'll add my provolone cheese, your tomato, another slice of provolone cheese, and some fresh basil. And you know what? I sprinkled just a little bit of olive oil, very little, because your other layer has. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to prepare the rest of them, and then we will be sticking them in the oven for about 15, 20 minutes until you see that your zucchini is quite cooked, but not overly cooked, and at 350 degrees. So I've just pulled them out of the oven. You guys, look at how sweet they look and they smell I'm delicious. In look at that. Today I chose not to put tomato sauce. You could also add a little bit of tomato sauce in between your zucchini and the cheese. So we hope you like this recipe. Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching Simply Delish Duo. And actually I'm not gonna stop there. This is healthy guys. It's got tomato, zucchini, Perfect side dish, excellent side dish to any meal. So yeah, please make this recipe, it is delicious.